it. Rock a they told the Filipino flamethrower that he just wasn't good enough. But with courage, determination, and a little mamba mentality, Jordan Clarkson was able to bounce back. Basketball is not only played physically with skills, you have to be there all mentally. Jordan Clarkson Jordan Taylor Clarkson's incredible basketball journey began in the Sunshine State back in 1992. He was born in Tampa, Florida on June 7th, but just six years into his life, Clarkson made the move down to San Antonio, Texas, where, at Karen Wagner High School, he really started to show what he could do on the court. But winning San Antonio's High School Player of the Year award wasn't enough to get Clarkson any recognition from the top colleges. Jordan wound up in Tulsa and played for two seasons before transferring to Missouri. After sitting out a season thanks to the NCAA's transfer rules, Clarkson began to catch fire on the court. But there would be one behemoth bump in Jordan Clarkson's road to the NBA, and it came in the form of some devastating news regarding his father. Mike Clarkson was diagnosed with a rare form of cancer, and it very nearly broke Jordan before he even made it to the big leagues. He was my best friend growing up. He shaped me into what I am today, Jordan Clarkson. Despite how hard he tried, the young basketball star simply couldn't keep the tragedy from infecting his on-court exploits. Clarkson was crushed. I tried to stay strong at the time. I told him he was going to be good and all right. I don't cry often, but that was one of the times I did. I just broke down in my room a little bit to myself. Jordan Clarkson Flamethrower's fire went out, and his numbers drastically dipped. The drop-off damaged Clarkson's draft stock, resulting in him being selected with the 46th pick in the 2014 NBA Draft. It wasn't all bad news, though. A blessing in disguise awaited Clarkson. Despite being picked by the Washington Wizards, a draft night trade would see him land a California dream and become a member of the Los Angeles Lakers. Jordan Clarkson had made it. He was suited up in the purple and gold he'd always dreamed of. But a career in the NBA was something Clarkson still had to earn. For the majority of the first half of his rookie season, Jordan was sent down to the G League to play for the Los Angeles Defenders. It seemed that Clarkson simply didn't have what it took, but a helping hand from one of the all-time greats would reach out and put Jordan back on track. That hand belonged to the legendary Laker, Kobe Bryant. Mamba mentality was all it took to pull Clarkson out of his development hell. He's had his hands on my career since I came into the league as a rookie. I didn't really know much about preparing for a game, the details of what really goes into this. He really kind of taught me everything. Jordan Clarkson Kobe's guidance set Clarkson up for the success he'd strived so hard for. Clarkson got back on the hardwood in the NBA. And on March 24th, he dropped 30 points and dished out 7 assists. Less than a week later, the young rookie notched back-to-back double-doubles. Clarkson's amazing turnaround resulted in him making the all-rookie first team, an achievement only four other second-round picks had ever managed in the 30 years prior. Jordan embraced the ideals of the Black Mamba and became a fearless scorer. He left LA in 2018, but will forever be grateful for the opportunity he had to live his dream. Words can't express what it meant to me to wear the purple and gold. As a kid from Texas, playing for the legendary Lakers was nothing short of a dream come true. Jordan Clarkson the Filipino flamethrower would eventually land in Utah in 2019. And as a player for the Jazz, Clarkson set out to prove once and for all that he has what it takes to be a star in the big league of basketball. For the 2021 season, Jordan Clarkson averaged 18.4 points per game, and he did this while coming off the bench. Clarkson became the very first Jazz player to win the NBA's Sixth Man of the Year award, and he cemented himself as one of the very best bucket getters in the game. When no one believed in Jordan Clarkson, he believed in himself. So remember to always have faith, because there just might be a black mamba waiting around the corner to lift you up and help you bounce back.